the Tiger 800 line, including two street-oriented cast wheel XRs and two spoke text C models, got a big overhaul. With power delivery from this 800cc triple in a happy place, Triumph chose to refine the chassis, work on creature comforts, and boost computing power in the ride raid package. There are a couple of reasons for this approach. First, for many of Triumph's markets there are horsepower restrictions, and the Tiger was already close to the magic 95 crankshaft horsepower limit for certain European countries with tiered licensing. Second, with 84 horsepower and 52 pound-feet of peak torque measured at the rear wheel on the Cycle World Dyno, the bike already has a sweet combination of power and a great torque spread. So why mess with it? Our original intent was to pair the Tiger with BMW's F800 GS Adventure, its only natural competitor available in the US, but with the German company unable to meet our request in time, we went off the beaten path solo. After riding the XCX last year in Spain, we've been waiting to sample this bike on home soil, the rougher the better. Chassis tweaks, much improved electronics, and the XC's more off-road oriented wheel package, in dirt-friendly 21-inch front, 17-inch rear sizes, boosted the bike's performance all around, but we wanted serious seat time to find where it stood on road and off. We requested the X package for our test bike which includes more